What's up guys, let's talk about how to increase power. And the simple answer is going to be train more troops, increase more power. But that's the simple answer. Let's talk about the hard one. Increasing your power without training troops. And there are lots of benefit to having high power without troops. It just shows that how strong your mansion build is. I have seen players that have 70 million power, 80 million power without any troops. It just shows that their mansion build is really strong. Especially if you are not elite 6, you are below elite 6. Having high power without troops is just very beneficial in events like city royal, family treasure event where player will mistake your mansion as a weak mansion because they will think that majority of your power comes from your troops and then they are going to attack you and later they are going to regret this. This kind of thing is really beneficial when you are even below elite 5, you are uh, elite 1, you are a mansion 26 a lot of players will just think that you have so many troops that they can kill but later when they attack they regret this so there is nothing wrong in having high power without troops it just show that your mansion build is really good really strong now let's talk about the sources from which you can get your total leader power if you will click on your avatar and then you are going to click the black dot it will show you the sources from you are getting your total leader power it's going to be your leader power crew power, building power, weapon power, contract power, human power, vigilante power. The biggest contribution in this is going to be your crew power of course that we have already mentioned a second ago that I just talked about. But if you will remove this, let's talk about the best ways that you can increase your power without having troops. And the biggest contribution in this is going to be your hitman agency. Doing investment in hitman agency is very crucial guys. I just talked about this in my previous video and that's not enough doing certain investment in hitman agency is going to give you lots of power for certain investment for example in equipment service there are many investment that is going to give you tons of power just for a single investment doing a single investment can give you up to 20,000 power per investment and if you are really grinding to do lots of hitman investment your total power without having any troops is, is going to increase a lot and that's going to make your mansion built really stronger it's just going to show that you have done a lot of investment in your mansion and your mansion build is really strong so i definitely recommend you to do lots of investment in hitman agency the best way to do this is going to be quickly going to elite 5 upgrading your hitman production building to elite 5 and then you are going to get tons of hitman coins that will help you to do a lot of hitman investment now apart from this building power is also very good way to get power without training any troops if you are going to upgrade your mansion upgrade the building inside your mansion the higher your building the more power they are going to get you so if you are an elite 5 try to level up all your building inside your mansion to elite 5 if you are elite 6 it's going to be the same so that will be the second thing that you need to do in order to have a high power without any troops. So the next one is going to be your equipment. In my eyes, equipment are very important for your stats, but they also provide you some power. The amount of power you are going to get from your equipment is going to depend upon the level of your equipment and the quality of your equipment. Now I think having equipment quality anything below gold is not acceptable. Competition now in the game is really high. So I just think you should have gold quality equipment. Now you guys can say to me you yourself doesn't have gold quality equipment and you are giving us lecture that we need to have. I have gold quality equipment. All of them are gold quality equipment you can see on your screen but these are biker equipment. I have them long time ago. When when I was playing biker now I start playing shooter so two of the equipments are not gold the level 20 pant is not gold yes because soon I'm going to get a level 43 gold quality pants and that's going to be it and after this I'm going to upgrade this level 35 to gold quality it's just that I'm lazy about this but you should definitely have gold quality equipment the higher the level of your equipment is going to be the more power you are going to get from them if you have set equipment they are going to provide you even more power so that's the way to increase your power through equipment now the last one but not the least is going to be your vigilante vigilante provide you lots of power and the more vigilante you are going to have the more power they are going to provide especially if you have many vigilantes that are level 30 level 40 level 50 they are going to give you lots of vigilante power and it's very beneficial in events like vigilante arena 
where the more stronger vigilante you have the more chances that you are going to rank higher in that kind of event the strongest player in the game have 33 million vigilante power just think about this guys that guy have more vigilante power than a lot of players in the game so you can get a lot of power having lots of vigilantes as well this is not the best way in my eyes but for sure it's going to be a very expensive way but it's not the best if you are just sticking to doing tons of hitman agency investment normal investment having gold quality equipment you are going to have a very strong mansion build so this is overall my guide to increasing your power without training troops and that's it for this video guys make sure you hit that like button subscribe the channel turn on post notification do all that good stuff and i'll catch you another one until then take care stay safe peace